What's up guys? This is Daniel and Houston. Houston and we're out in the high tunnel this evening. I promised you guys in the last video that we were going to be picking all of our onions so I couldn't get out here and pick all those onions without my sidekick. And if you remember I did that live video about the uh, growing the biggest cucumber challenge. Well I messed up. <laughs> I forgot to tell my gardening sidekick which cucumber I was saving for the biggest cucumber challenge and look here Houston came out here to the greenhouse You're the winner. first thing he did was run over to the cucumbers and go oh dad a huge cucumber and he picked it why'd you pick it who'd you pick it for nanny. he picked it for his nanny because he thought his nanny would like that big cucumber so we're gonna have to let another one start growing and we'll, we'll get a big cucumber. We'll maybe get two or three big cucumbers. Or well, like a giant, giant one all the way to the top of the sky. You think you can grow a giant one all the way to the top of the sky? Yeah. Well, so we're going to harvest all of our onions that were planted in the raised bed. Um, we, we put the video up on those onions when we planted them. I think that was March 6th. And if you haven't watched that video, Daddy, what? When, have we, when did we plant those strawberries strawberries yeah. um in march but we planted those onions and posted that video i think it was march 6th so they've been in the ground right at three months some of them have done pretty good there's some pretty good sized onions but there's still some that didn't do much at all so <clears throat> i'm gonna let this guy go pull all the onions and we'll get them all lined up on a table and show them to everybody myself? you're gonna go pull a bunch of onions you think you can pull them not by myself not by yourself it is not hard to pick an onion. You can pull an onion. All right, let's go. Let's see. Okay, so here's our main raised bed, uh, our main bed of onions. Some of them aren't very big, like the one Houston just picked. But there's still quite a few. There's plenty that are pretty good size. They're not giant by any means. But for the most part, they've all laid over and they're pretty well finished growing so I'm gonna let little man start pulling onions you find any big ones Houston yep. let me see that's a pretty big onion good job Look at that next one right there. That's a pretty big one. Whoa! That's a good one. Uh, uh. Good job, Houston. That looks so big. So big, huh? Yeah. biggest onions they're not just like baseball softball size we didn't like have just the most awesome onion um, season but that's okay we did pretty good we still got a ton of onions that we can store a hundred a hundred I don't think you counted 
So we're gonna leave these out here on this table, out here in the high tunnel for a day or two and let them dry out and cure really well. And then we'll get them either in the, in the house or in the barn and store them. Um, and they should last us several months. There's enough onions here. I mean, we, we, my wife cooks with a lot of onions, but there's a lot of onions over here. So, uh, you know, overall, probably didn't have the most successful season with onions, but this isn't too shabby. These are pretty good size onions right here. And I will say this, I am not an onion grower. I've never been able to grow those huge, just massive onions. Apparently Houston has, and it's hot in here, and it is, um... Cucumber! Houston went and got his cucumber. So, let me have my towel back. It's hot. Woo! It's hot. Houston picked our cucumber, so, oh well, it's all right. No yeah. big deal. Yeah. So, there's what we uh, came up with on our onions for this year. We still have some in the ground, and we'll probably grow some more in the fall just to see how a fall crop of onions does inside plastic under um, the high tunnel. So, that's uh, a pretty good haul of onions for me. I'm satisfied. Kale. You got some kale over there? Kale. Yeah. Kale. Do you eat kale? What are these? Oh, a whole bunch of different stuff. So, I don't know what this is. Overall, I'm satisfied. Uh, it's a lot of onions we don't have to buy, so huh, there you go. So anyways, that's what we got. That's how our uh, onion harvest went for this year. And uh, we'll, like I said, we'll plant some more in the fall and see how it goes. So thanks for watching, guys. We do appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Say subscribe to our channel. Subscribe to our channel. And like our videos. And like, if you like our videos, for right. Uh, um... <laughs> all right guys thanks for watching we do appreciate it give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video um let me know how you do on your onion harvest i mean, this is not, not a competition but uh let me know how your onions went for this year houston's gonna try to knock my tripod over here uh leave me a comment below if this is pretty much average for what you would expect on one raised bed three foot by eight foot i don't know first time growing onions in the high tunnel but anyways Thanks for watching, guys. I do appreciate it, and we'll see you on the next video.